Hey there, welcome to another marriage replenishment message from The Color of Marriage. Imagine this, nearly 40% of married individuals admit to infidelity in one form or another. Quite a shocking revelation, isn't it? It's as if the sacred bond of marriage is being stretched to its limits. But let's not lose hope. This alarming figure underscores the pressing need for honoring faithfulness in marriages. It's a cornerstone that, when respected, can lead to remarkable greatness in a union. It's a sobering statistic, but it brings to light the importance of faithfulness in marriage. The Bible offers wisdom on this matter. In Hebrews 13, 4, we're reminded to hold marriage in honor among all. This verse serves as a reminder of the sanctity of marriage and the importance of maintaining purity within it. In Galatians, we're directed to walk by the Spirit, steering clear of fulfilling desires of the flesh, a strong solution for avoiding temptation. 1 Corinthians 10, 13 gives us assurance, affirming that God is faithful and won't allow us to be tempted beyond our limits. It also promises a way of escape, a testament to God's mercy. Furthermore, 1 Corinthians chapter 7 verse 5 directs couples not to deprive one another sexually except by mutual consent, and for a time, so that they may devote themselves to fasting and prayer. However, this same verse also instructs them to come together again, so that Satan does not tempt them, because of their lack of self-control. These scriptures remind us of our duty to our spouses and the potential consequences of straying from our vows. Every now and then, someone of the opposite sex may capture our attention. It's what we do in those moments that matters. Imagine if, in those moments we chose not to act on impulse, but instead, to honor the sanctity of our marriage. This isn't about denying that the attraction exists, it's about making a conscious decision to uphold our vows, to respect our partners, and to protect the sacred bond we share. Think about it. What if, when temptation arises we chose to respond with kindness with love with respect, these intentional actions can become the pillars of our marriage, fortifying it against any storm. So let's make up our minds today, to choose right over wrong, love over lust, unity over discord. By honoring the sanctity of your marriage and choosing intentional actions that uphold your vows, you can move your marriage to greatness. Keep this in mind and watch the transformation unfold. If you haven't already please subscribe to our channel to see more videos like this. Also if you agree with this message and feel others should hear it, please share and like it.